Hello everyone, welcome back to this Microsoft Excel tutorial journey with me on my Knowledge Factor YouTube channel. This is our 57th session and today let's take a look at one more option inside the print setting. Now I give you a scenario here. You have got a larger document but you only want to print a specific section or area of the document. I don't want to print all of it, just an area. Looking at our worksheet here, perhaps I just want to like print this area, right? that's it nothing else i don't want to print the title at the top the little arrow the mean max average my chart the smart art i just want to print this area right there right there's actually a couple of different ways to do this the first one is really simple to do you just highlight there whatever you want to print you have to go to the file in the print option or you can use the shortcut key for printing like Control p right inside the print setting area um, i get to tell it what to print currently it's printing the active sheet right so all the content if i go to the little drop down here there's an option for print selection i'll grab that and now i'm printing just the selected area that's it no chart no smart art no no extra formulas that we created there none of that title at the top just the content i had selected and that's nice right now there's going to come times you get larger documents i don't need everything on there i just need a section or area of the document make the selection and then print the selection right now that's one option the other option is if it's something common every week i get this document that comes to me and i print just a section of the document and every week that data gets updated but i just want the one section well if it's that common then there's another option you can set up a print area take a look i'm going to go back to my normal layout view right i'll go up to my page layout tab and there's an option for print area now first thing i do here is i selected the data that i want to set up as a print area or the area that i want to print then i'll go to the print area and i'll set the print area that's it so now i could have anything selected out there doesn't matter what right i can go back to my print by shortcut key again Control p and i get just that area that's it still print active sheets I'm not doing print selection because I had an empty cell out there selected. But if this is something common enough, set up the print area, right? Then you can manipulate all your other settings like centering on the page and your margins and your header and footer. But you have got that print area. Now, if you don't want the print area, at least at that moment, you do have the option to ignore print area. That will take me back to the default. Right? And that way you keep the print area around when you need it. When you don't need it then you can ignore it and get back in there and i can just go again and uncheck that and get back to my print area so you get a couple of options print selection or if it's common something you do pretty regular then set up a print area manage your print settings and you are good to go thanks for watching this tutorial and as i always say if you really liked it and enjoying this journey then please do like and subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon to get the latest content update on this channel Alright then, we'll meet up in the next session in case you have any questions, any concerns, then do let me know in the comment section of this video. Till the time, goodbye and take care.